Hey guys, it's David Packer, and if you don't know me, I'm on a mission to lose 300 pounds. And in today's video, I thought since it's the last Sunday of the year, the last video of the year for me, that it might be kind of a fun to do a year kind of recap summary and a look back. And then at the end, of course, a look forward to what to expect next year. Hope you all are having a fantastic holiday season here. My family and I, obviously, we just wrapped up Christmas for us. And my wife got me a really cool gift I wanted to show you guys. So let me pull this out here. I don't know if you could see that. This is a statue that maybe you've seen around online. It's called the Self-Made Man. And I just love it because, I mean, this guy in the bottom half looks kind of like me now or more probably at the beginning of the year I looked a little bit more like that and I don't know if I'm going exactly for this six packs and all that but um, definitely you know the guy on top is more of what I'm looking to look like and just to get healthier so I, I really like the um, imagery in that statue 2021 was a lot like that statue for me it was slowly chipping away at things that weren't good for me that uh, kind of weighed me down including the physical weight as well as other things so it's been a long year and a difficult year at times but I wouldn't change it for the world I was thinking the other day about you know if somebody would have told me at the beginning of the year hey you can either have 50 grand or you can be down 120 pounds I would no question about it you can make it 100 grand no question about it I would take being down 120 pounds and that's currently what I'm down 120 pounds lost in 2021 and so that's probably about what it will be by the end of the year since there's only a few days left. I think it would be nice to push a little bit more and get to 125 pounds lost in the year because then if I could duplicate that next year it would be 250 total so that would be you know I just would be extremely happy with that. But the weight wasn't the only thing that we did this year to improve the quality of my life. We also went to the doctor and got my CPAP machine and I showed you all that on my videos and that has been a huge blessing to have. Another couple of victories that we had this year where we were able to lower my unhealthy cholesterol. We were able to get my blood pressure out of that hypertension range down into a normal range so that, that was huge. We're able to now buckle into a regular seatbelt in a vehicle, which is something small, but again, uh, means a lot. And we were able to quit my corporate job that was causing me a lot of stress and really dragging me down emotionally and mentally. And we have a new job that I love, that I get to be creative, and so it's just a lot better situation. So that's kind of, you know, some of the highlights of 2021. I was also looking back at some of the 2021 videos that we shared and we had a lot of things like working on the backyard, we had plucking, we had uh, doing the Goodwill Fitness Challenge, doing the Pokemon Fitness Challenge, and trying out our favorite fast food places that had healthy options. So I guess the bottom line is there's a lot of things about my life that wouldn't be as awesome as they are if it wasn't for trying to lose the weight, starting the YouTube channel, and connecting with awesome people like you. I think I maybe mentioned this once before, but uh, I was talking to a buddy and they said, do you think you would have lost the weight if you hadn't had your YouTube channel? And I truthfully, honestly think the answer is no. And I don't, I'm not proud of that. I don't think that maybe that's the right attitude to have, but that, that is what it is. I think that having the YouTube channel really it motivated me to try to stay on top of things. You know, we had a couple of stalls, we missed a couple of Sundays, but overall having a, a commitment to you all to say, hey, I'm gonna be here, I'm gonna show you what I'm doing, what I've been working on, what I'm excited about, and hopefully have some good news for you. And I think that that commitment to you all on YouTube and Instagram are really the only two I use, has really spurred me on to have the success that I have had. So I definitely want to continue that into 2022 and hopefully continue to have that success. So in a way, you can really give yourself a, a pat on the back for helping me out. I really appreciate it. I was just looking back at the motivating myself video and at the time I was about 75 pounds down and it's just crazy to think that since then I lost another 50 pounds, well, 
45 pounds. So that's pretty much it for the video. Thank you so much again. And I think we're going to have a lot of fun next year. If you're still here watching this part, I'll show you kind of a sneak preview. Uh, my wife got me this for my uh, Christmas gift, the Oculus Quest 2. So I think it's going to be fun. Now, I'm going to definitely make a video on, you know, having fun and exercising with that. I still got to set it up. So thank you again. No matter your girth, you have worth. And I'll see you next year.